Okay, <clears throat> here we are in a step up. Great townhouse over three floors. Huge roof terrace. Historical a step up. Good bonus here is a not an overly huge garage, but uh, well, you know, if you get a car in here or not, be tight. But anyway, added space. We're sort of coming through the garage entrance. But there is another door, which I'll show you in a sec. Good sized lounge, air conditioned as well. A formal dining room here as well. Back in the dining room. <clears throat> Very nice marble staircase leading up. Very typical arched Sevillian style staircase. Good space underneath it as well. Desk, computer. Let's go into the kitchen. Compact, user friendly. And you've got a utility room as well, washer dryer. And then this door leads out onto a cute little patio with a lemon tree, obligatory lemon tree. If you're in Spain and you don't have a lemon tree, you're missing the whole idea. And there's the street door there, which is why of course, we entered through the garage. This takes you into the terrace patio. And then here, very handy. Got a little larger dispensa, as it's called in Spanish. Pantry, as it's called in Canadian. And then back to the garage, lounge, and stairs leading up. Okay, we're on the second story now. Three good-sized bedrooms, two of them with air conditioning. We're in the washroom. Probably use a little modernization, but you know, functions and so forth. And here you've just got sort of a little anteroom. Oop! That wasn't supposed to be a zoom. Which, you know, potentially you could just open it up and, you know, that whole space there, you know, could be used. Then here we've got the first bedroom, all street facing, lots of light, as you can see, good amount of space. I'd say this is about a single and a half, although a double bed would fit in here pretty, pretty easily. Oh yeah, heat in the winter, air conditioning in the summer. I think you need them both. The step up, if you may not know, gets, uh, gets quite hot. <clears throat> It'll get into the 40s here. Always a nice breeze, mountains around, as we'll see from the roof terrace. So we're sort of in a bowl here, which always creates a little bit of a breeze, a little respite from the heat. Bedroom number two, a little bit bigger, good size, and whoosh, air conditioning. Okay. And then into the third bedroom, but the same size as the first bedroom. That's a good one. No air conditioning in here. <coughs> Excuse me. And then you've got, you know, a great view down onto this little plaza which, um, you know, is right at the beginning of the house. Very quiet street as well. Although we are only about five minutes down to the main street walking. And then you've got potential there for built-in wardrobe. Let's go back out into the hall. And up the stairs. Doom, doom, doom. To, to the 
Sun Terrace, <coughs> which, you know, typically the Spaniards use for hanging laundry. So the owner has warned me not to garrote myself on the laundry line. So here's the roof terrace, which is, as you can see is a, a fair size. Just get underneath the wire as to not garrote myself. And then you've got just some great, great views onto the countryside. We're sort of southwest uh, facing now, heading down toward Malaga. I'll just give you a little bit of a close up. Fortunately, it's a little bit hazy today, so you can't see those sort of mountains over there. Get back into focus. Uh, lead on to Puente Camille, Cordoba. Just a pleasant little space, not overlooked. Well, kind of overlooked there, but typically the Spaniards use these roof terraces to hang laundry, not to sunbathe like us sun-starved foreigners. Okay, and then let's go into this great little room here, which, you know, has some good potential as well. Uh-huh. Storage, another bedroom, place to get out of the sun. Be easy enough if you wanted to, to draw water up here. Put a shower, little kitchen, barbecue area. We're essentially standing over the bathroom below now, so to draw uh, water up here would be fairly painless, inexpensive, and the next thing you know, you've got a shower. Okay, so we'll finish off another view of the Sun Terrace. So here in Steppa, three bed, one bath, potential for another bath uh, as well. Great views, close to the center. Very, very good condition. Use a little bit of TLC, a little bit of decoration, but otherwise plenty of space, very well located, and a very good price.